Do you remember last year when a company that was funded by the Australian military immersed tiny human brains grown in jars in Game World demonstrated that they were sentient? but also kind of sort of created the matrix. Well, it's gotten a lot better. What you're seeing behind me is a virtual world where brain organoids were given a butterfly body. They're receiving sensory input from a game world. They weren't trained or taught to do this. They were just given the body. If they were to think they were anything, they'd probably think they're a butterfly. Yes, this is the very same Swiss company that is selling brain organoid computation as a subscription model where you can rent out 16 tiny brains and have them work for you. This is truly an amazing feat in computation, engineering, and biological sciences. But we are essentially creating and perfecting the matrix. I actually found out about this because Final Spark let me join their Discord and I'm waiting for them to regret it. Please don't kick me out of Discord. If this kind of progress happened in a year, imagine where we'll be in 10. This tells us a lot about how we can connect a human brain to machines. They also sent me this video. This is one of the very first brain organoid robots. This all happened around 2008. A brain in a jar is remotely controlling this little guy here. This is what happens when we give them sensory input in the real world. I've also been informed that these are technically cyborgs. I really give it just one year before somebody pops it into a humanoid robot if it hasn't already been done.